Hello, um, my name is Dan. Hello, my name is Dan. I just wanted to let you know that I called NASA and said, may, may I please buy uh, some of the photos of the landing sites uh, that we had on the moon. They said, no, it's all there for free. So let me show you, first of all, the Apollo 11 landing site. If you'd like to hold that up. Um, yeah, and you can see uh, where all the footprints are. Uh, where the experiments are, um, where the eagle had landed um, on the moon. Now, next, let's present Apollo 12. Yeah, you have to get your photo paper ready, folks. There's the Apollo 12. That's the Intrepid. There's the footprints of astronauts um, Alan Bean and um, Pete Conrad. Also, you could see Surveyor 3 there. Now, although Apollo 13 could not land on the moon, um, we can show you a great impact crater made by its third stage booster. One of the great uh, mission successes was that, picked up by the Apollo 12 seismometer. Okay, now let's go to Apollo 14. We could see where the Antares had landed. We could see the footprints of Edgar Mitchell and Alan Shepard. Um, all over the place there. Okay, great. All right, let's let's go to Apollo 15. Now Apollo 15. Okay, you can see where the Falcon had landed. You can see uh, several of the important craters uh, where the experiments packages uh, were placed, etc. All right. Now we can go to Apollo 16 and its landing site and. These recent pictures, again, now taken up uh, the Apollo 16, uh, that is the Orion. And then, of course, I think you can see, well, I can see the footprints of John Young and Charles Duke, who had walked on the moon there. Now, we can go to Apollo 17. Apollo 17, um, that's the Challenger, the original Challenger. Um, that, that lies in the Taurus littoral valley of the moon. And then uh, we have whatever we could see there. Here, I can't see it too well from here, but. Looks like the flag and the okay, uh, lunar the module base. Okay, so you've got the Challenger base mm -hmm. there. And then, um, as an extra, this is a, this is a map of the geological site studied by the Apollo 14 astronauts. Okay, and that's, uh, you can see Cone Crater up, up to the right hand of your screen. Okay, that's it. And it's all for free. You don't have to worry about it. Get out your good, um, your nice paper and make prints for yourself. It's yeah. all for you from NASA. Yeah, you okay, wanna, wanna, take care folks. Uh, have a nice week. You want to go to nasa.org, I believe it is. Well, it was at nasa.org. Or NASA. I think it was nasa.org, but oh, okay. uh, you can you well, can check it out. Well, what website it is? Uh, that's the go to the NASA website, and these uh, photos are free for you to uh, print out. Exactly, because I, I thought I'd have to buy these things, and they just said no, it's all free. And I said, well, wow, this is fantastic. I can make these prints for myself, and and have them. Because I, I want to tell you, um, some people that are not in the business of doing it is JPL. Um, also, who else is not in the business? That's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. Oh, yeah, exactly. JPL is not in the business. Also, um, the superintendent of documents, government printing office, is also out of the business right now of doing that. Mm -hmm. You have to go directly to NASA, um, download these things, and make your own prints. Okay, take care, folks. Hope your Thanksgiving went really well, and we'll talk to you next time. Thank you. We should have music next time. Yes, that, okay. that'll be a good idea. Thank you. All right, take okay. care. Okay, uh-huh. Okay, bye-bye. Uh -huh.